In this video, we're going to talk about common nouns and proper nouns. Why do you need to know the difference between common nouns and proper nouns? Well, it's to ensure that you use capital letters correctly. Here's a common mistake that people make. When they have an important word in their sentence, like brochure, in this sentence, then they give it a capital letter. Well, actually, that's wrong. It's a common noun. We value our client's opinion. Well, a very important word in the sentence, but it doesn't get a capital letter. So the ruling is, don't give a word a capital letter just because it's an important word in your sentence. There's a ruling for when nouns get capital letters. So let's start by looking at common nouns. A common noun is the word we use for something. So a boy, for example, a cat. A bridge, a lake. It's just the word we use. And these are all written in lowercase. And that's the key point here. So common nouns contrast with proper nouns. And the proper noun is the name of something. So the given name. So this will be clear from the examples. So Peter, lucky, as in the name of a dog or a cat, Lake Superior, London Bridge. Now these given names are written in uppercase, as you can see. So let's do a side-by-side -side comparison of common nouns and proper nouns. Remembering a common noun is just the word for something, allows us to talk about it, and the proper noun is the name of something. So we've got dog, that dog might be called Lucky, Rex or Rover. We've got car, and the brand of that car might be a Ford, a Jaguar, or a Mini Cooper. We've got lake, Great Salt Lake, for example, the name of a lake. A bridge, Tower Bridge, the name of a famous bridge in London. So let's look at some example sentences. And in these examples, we're going to have the common nouns in blue and the proper nouns in green. So life within the Kremlin was shrouded in impenetrable secrecy. Well, life is a common noun. So we've just said that common nouns are written with lowercase letters, but not when they start a sentence. That's the time when you can give a common noun a capital letter. So life within the Kremlin, with a capital K, because it's the name of a citadel in Moscow, was shrouded in impenetrable secrecy. Secrecy is just a common noun, lowercase letter. And that's a quote by Harrison Salisbury. Let's look at the next example. All water tastes the same. There's a reason why Evian is naive backwards. So in this sentence, we have three nouns. Uh, two are common nouns with lowercase letters, and one is a proper noun with an uppercase letter. Let's look at the third example. Sparks Meadow mineral water is the most expensive bottled water. So here we've got Sparks Meadow mineral water uh, with capital letters. And then we've got the word water at the end, which is a common noun. Oh dear, it seems to have a capital letter. Well, that would be wrong. So this is a mistake. That should be a lowercase w for a common noun. And while we're at it, looking up at the first example, Harrison Salisbury is obviously his name, so that is a proper noun too. So let's just summarize this. Common noun. It's the word for something, e.g. person, city, canyon. And they're lowercase unless they start a sentence. And then we've got proper nouns, the name of something. So Simon, Madrid, Grand Canyon. And these are written in uppercase. Okay, we haven't quite finished yet. There's one more thing I would want to say about common nouns. Every common noun can be further categorized as at least one of the following types of noun. An abstract noun, a collective noun, a compound noun, a concrete noun, a countable noun, a non-countable noun, a gender-specific noun, or a verbal noun. We're not going to go through these in this video. And if you want to read about these, then you can pause this video. 
or you can go to Grammar Monster where we've got lessons and tests and more videos on each of these noun types. Thanks for watching and be sure to check out some of our other videos on GrammarMonster.com and you'll also find us on Twitter and on Facebook.